Hastings is our town, you know it well. From the welcome sign to the high school bell. You say you know it well, that's not quite true. Cause with Take a Hike Mike, I'll prove it to you. There's lesser known businesses and some you've heard of more. But it doesn't bother me cause I just love to explore. Interviewing owners and lending a hand. I'd love to assist for as long as they can stand. Where will I go next? I really can't say. Here's a little warning, cause it might be your way. No matter where I go, one thing is true. With Take a Hike, Mike, it's entertainment for you. H2, oh my goodness, have I got a hike for you. I'm Mike Bramer, and today I'm at the Hastings Wastewater Treatment Plant. I'll be meeting up with plant manager Jay Sockness to learn what happens to our water. And believe me, there is nothing shallow about it. Along the way, this hike starts to stink a bit, as Jay has me raking out debris and even becoming a judge of the sludge. What are we waiting for? Let's hike inside and get started. Come on. Well, hello, Jay. How you doing? You are? I am Mike. Take a hike, Mike. How's it going, sir? Good. How's it going with you? It's going incredible. I don't know what's going on here. This is a water treatment plant. Is that right, sir? Well, it's a wastewater treatment waste plant. Wastewater treatment plant. Yes. Okay. So I won't be drinking this water then? Well, we could try that, but I don't think it'd probably, be good for you. Probably won't yeah. taste too good. Not today. Okay. So, so kind of in a nutshell, what happens here? Well, the water that you flush down your toilet, mm -hmm. down your sinks, down your drains, we take that gray, nasty water and we turn it into water that's just about drinking quality and return that water to the river. Okay, so if I was to flush your toilet here in your facility, would it just show up in the next room and you guys treat it? Yep. Oh, wow, okay, yep. that's convenient, right? Yeah, <laughs> first of all, before we go anywhere, oh, wow. let's protect the eyes. Okay. Put those on. These are like cool, uh, cool shades. Yeah. They're very becoming. The, the ladies will dig these, Absolutely. I assume? Okay, yeah. okay, yeah. I'm gonna yeah. take your word for it. All right, and I think the best way to show you what's going on mm -hmm. is to actually take the tour. Okay, well, let's begin. Can I set my bindle stick down somewhere? Sure, let's do that. Okay, right here on the floor? Good enough. Oh, good enough. <laughs> <laughs> Water first comes into the plant and goes into what we call a bar screen. Bar screen, okay. And the bar screen basically is just taking care of the big chunks. Okay. Rags, saying. sticks, and oh, I see we got all kinds of them. I was going to say, I'm very familiar with bars, but uh, not this type of bar. But not this kind of bar. <laughs> oh, you want wow. to go in and take a quick lap. Okay. Whoa, look at this. This is dirty. This is nasty. Dirty and smelly. Yeah. 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 I've been called that before, too. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the main area where the waste comes in. Yep, raw, the raw, raw waste, waste water. comes in here. You can hear that in the background. Mm -hmm. That's the water coming, splashing into the plant. All right, so the rags will be coming up here? Yeah. Oh, here we go. This is exciting. Here, here it comes. Go. Oh, look at that, viewers. Isn't that wonderful? Wow. Have you ever found something really unique or weird come through, like well, a, a pet alligator or something like that? Money. We jump on the money. Maybe that's just people tipping you. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So, so this looks like a... Big pump area. This is like the science room, kind of. Yeah. Like there's big computers and... Yeah. Yep, everything is operated automatically. The pumps follow the flow coming in. So if we have five gallons a minute, they're mm -hmm. gonna pump five uh, gallons at a time. If we have a thousand gallons, they're gonna speed up and go wow. to a thousand gallons a minute. So what would happen if I just pushed like a button? Would everything go haywire? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we'd, be, we'd be flooding the neighbor's basement. And you'd probably be and flooding me right out of yeah. this, uh, this yeah. plant earlier than planned. <laughs> the water that we heard Mm -hmm. cascading on the other side of this yep. wall not coming through and being pumped through the plant. Okay. So that water comes in at about 30 feet below the surface, mm -hmm. the ground surface here. Now it gets pumped up to the primary tanks and everything there runs for gravity down to the river. Mm -hmm. But we got to get it there so we have to put it through these pumps. What would happen if I turned this? Well, it would close that water okay, off so. and then we would be flooding out the neighbor's oh my goodness. house again. There's a lot of things I could do that would cause this plant to go haywire. So yes. I'm gonna have to make sure I'm on my best behavior, Absolutely. right, Jay? Best behavior. Yep. The water Whoa. gets pumped from downstairs. Okay. Wow, this looks cool. So we're gonna go in this dome area. It smells kind of stuffy in here, kind of like a sewer, Jay. Yeah, that's, that's what you got. <laughs> cool. Whoa. 
This is crazy. Wow, I feel like I'm walking the plank right now. There's a ton of water under us. So Look this is this. your raw wastewater. Raw wastewater, okay. It comes in from the plant. The only thing we've done is taken the rags out, the biggest stuff out. Yep. In here, we're trying to remove everything that floats. Mm -hmm. So your greases that you might throw down the kitchen sink after mm -hmm. you wash your dishes. Yep. And all your sinkers. Okay. Those are the things typically you flush down the toilet. Yes. How deep is this water in here? 12 feet. 12 feet deep, yep. okay. And at any given time, we probably have about a foot to three feet bed okay. of those solids on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Do you wear a lot so, of cologne? Uh, I like to take a shower when I'm done. When you're done, day. you take a shower? Mm -hmm. Yes. If I was a guy that would shower, I would probably shower after this. Yeah, I'm yeah a, I kind I'm of a, noticed that about you. I didn't I, know if it was the plant I, or you. I figured oh. I didn't need to shower today. I just blame it on the plant. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm on the one a week plan. <laughs> Whether you need it or not. Exactly. <laughs> All right, viewers, we're in the operator's control room. It's time for Take a Hike Trivia. All right, Jay, name these individuals that have a water term in their name. Here's the first one. Waterman. Waterman? Oh, you're close. It's not it's not the word. Aquaman. Word. Hey, there you go. All right, he's got one point. He's on the board. I'm Next not up. up with the, uh, superheroes. How about this here? There's a water term in his name. Waterboy. Hey, there we go. How about this woman here, Jay? Rivers. Okay. Uh, First name? Joan. There you go. Three for three so far. You got one more. Let's take it home strong, Jay. Let's take it home strong. It's a turtle. Okay, you're close. You're close. It's this, not a ninja turtle. No, no. This is a Pokemon. It rhymes with turtle and think water terms. Starts with the letter S. Turtle. Oh, oh, add a QU in there. You got it. Squirtle. There you go. <laughs> I'll give you half point there. So what is that? Three and a half points there, Jay? <laughs> wow. Nice. You know your water terms and water characters. <laughs> this guy's good. Yeah. That was a splash of fun. <laughs> Once we get the floaters and sinkers out of the water, mm -hmm. yep. we still have that gray water. Yep. And what we try to do with that gray water is get those suspended solids that mm -hmm. make that water gray. We take those from being suspended to sinkers. Mm -hmm. We do that over here in the aeration tank. This plant kind of came online in the mid 80s. Mm -hmm. They're different. Uh, uh, industries in town mm -hmm. that flush down some liquids that really help make this a stinky place. Okay. We got a lot of uh, complaints from the neighbors. We decided we had to do something. Yeah, that stinks. So we domed out here. <laughs> <laughs> so do you ever go inside these areas well, here? Well, I'll show you the inside. Oh, Don't wow. fall in because you won't swim. Whoa, okay. So how yeah. far down is this going to go here? It's about 20 foot deep in Whoa, here. Whoa, 20 You're, foot. What you'll see is, you know, when my kids were little, I always, they'd come down to the plant, bring me lunch on the weekend or something. Yeah. And I, they'd say, Daddy, let's go look at the chocolate milk. Oh. So this is chocolate milk up here. You're getting me excited, but I don't think I should be excited again. I don't think, no. No. Whoa. You can see it comes to the top, but that, that tank's about 20 feet deep. Wow, that's fascinating, Jay. What's going on in there is just mm -hmm. millions and millions of little bugs. Okay. That are being aerated, mm -hmm. so we keep air going in there. Keep mm -hmm. a dissolve rate of about two or higher. Yep. Two parts per million mm -hmm. or higher. And those little bugs are eating up those suspended solids in our gray water. Okay. And that's what makes them sink to the bottom once they're done. So these bugs work for you? They work for Do me. Do they get paid pretty well? They don't. They get to eat free. <laughs> hey, there we go. Yes. Got a generator in case we lose power. Yep. If yep. we lose power, <clears throat> again, we're at risk of either putting water in the river or mm -hmm. somebody's basement. That's yep. never a pleasant thing. Yep. What would you rather have? Um, I'd rather it go to the river. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm Sorry. sure the neighbors appreciate the hearing neighbors that as well. appreciate that, yes. <laughs> Nice and loud in here. Yeah. What? Yeah. What? Lower suction. This room totally blows in a good way. These are some of the older blowers. This is like a material. It looks soft to the touch. Yep. Keeps the temperature in this room down. It's insulation. Do you ever train on this like a punching bag? Oh, I've been tempted. <laughs> <laughs> After dealing with me for a couple hours, he might be ready to. Cool. More pumps. More pumps. Okay. Yep. 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 In the the next system, the final tanks. Yep. That water comes out, that chocolate milk. Yep. Comes over to the final tanks, mm -hmm. settles in the bottom of those tanks. Some of that chocolate, we mm -hmm. pump back up to the aeration tanks with these pumps. Mm -hmm. Some of it we waste off, and that waste also ends up in the primary tanks, mm -hmm. blends with that, and we haul it out of here. Have you ever had any leaks or spills? We've had just very, very few. I was gonna say, don't very cry few. over spilled milk, right? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I can go all day with these bad jokes. 
<laughs> Alright, so viewers, right now, just to give you a sense of where we are, we got the Hastings Bridge over there, and just down the river, here we are at the Water Waste Treatment Plant. So what's going on with these big, uh, cool cylindrical items over here, Jay? More tankage. More tankage. Swimming pools. More swimming pools, I like it. A little bit cleaner water. Okay, okay. Final tanks. So the chocolate milk yep. ends up in the final tanks. Cool, let's check out the final tanks. Yeah. This is cool. Yeah. This is cool. So it's essentially like our primary tank. This it's looks pretty the clean. clean water. It looks pretty clean, yeah. Jay. Oh yeah. Okay, so is this the water that's clean enough to send out or what's happening yep. here? Okay. Yep. If you look in the middle, mm -hmm. notice how brown that is? Yes. So that's the water coming out of the aeration tanks. Okay. Comes up in the middle. Mm -hmm. On the bottom of the tank here, we'll probably have anywhere from a foot to two feet mm -hmm. of solids, those bugs that we have in the aeration yep. tanks. Yep. And um, this arm mm -hmm. has got a little sucker on the bottom of it that will suck that stuff up mm -hmm. and with the return pumps up here, return it back up mm -hmm. to the aeration tanks. They've got what we call a sludge judge. Okay. I can have you do a, you want to do a sludge judge? You want to oh, judge some sludge? Yes. Let's That's go. That's been my dream my whole life. I bet. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Whoa. Get a good grip. Okay. So I All grab right. this thing? All right. Yep. So I'm going to judge the sludge now, viewers. So. All right. What we're doing with a sludge judge here is we're okay. actually determining how many feet of sludge are on the bottom, if okay. there is any. Wow, okay, so, so we, the pole goes down. We typically lower that in the water. The tube goes down, all the way. All right, I've got a good hold, Jay, don't worry. Go ahead, go all the way down. All right, we're gonna take her down. So you hit the bottom. All right, I'm on the bottom. All right, now give it a, just a slight jerk. Okay. And pull it up. All right, here we go. Let's see what kind of sludge we got in here. Any predictions, Jay? I'm gonna say we got a foot in there. What do you think? I'm gonna say half a foot. All right. Let's see who's right. Place your bets now. Wow, this is a tall oh, tube. We got eight inches. Eight inches, okay. Uh, okay. Split decision. Yeah. So I take the win, right? Yeah. Whoa, this is heavy. Watch yourself. Oh, whoa! Okay, that's spraying sludge everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> so what are your thoughts on eight inches of sludge? That's better than you right thought. Right about where we should be. A little better than you thought. Right about, yeah. So the take a hike mic effect is already happening. So where to now, Jay? Well, now we go to disinfection. Ooh, disinfection, okay. Where are you I, going? Oh, the here. wrong way apparently. <laughs> I was afraid you were gonna make me take a shower and I panicked. <laughs> <laughs> disinfection season, mm -hmm. when we kill all the bugs, is from mm -hmm. March 1st to November 1st. This plant uses bleach, mm -hmm. the, the chlorine in the bleach, to kill the pathogens before they go to the river. Okay. Um, this would be the, the tankage, so we'd pump in a little bit on one end. It would serpentine itself through. Oh, interesting. So it serpentines through. Yep. Kind of like a, a mouse maze almost. Yeah. Okay. okay. And you got to have about a half hour contact time with that bleach mm -hmm. and the water before it goes out. Mm -hmm. And then before it goes out to the river, we got to get rid of that chlorine. Yep. So we add another chemical, sodium bisulfite, to that. Mm -hmm. And it instantly takes out any chlorine. Okay. A lot of times I wash my clothes with bleach. Do you ever bring in your whites and just... Uh, well, this is a little bit stronger than what you use A little bit stronger, okay. Yeah, if you want any clothes left at all, you, you wouldn't want to use <laughs> okay. this stuff. Okay, okay. So, ixnay yeah. on that idea. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, interesting. This is water taken right out of our chlorine contact tank. Okay. The little serpentine tank. And you can see how clean that is. Yeah, look at that. And you can also see how clean they keep everything around here. Yep. This is our sample. This is the water going to the river. So does this little spoon come down? Yep, comes just down. Just dip it in. Dips and dips. And then there's a bucket in a in a refrigerator. Is there anything I need to do with helping with the sample or? Right now, no. Mm -hmm. There's no chlorine residual. Yep. Because we're out of chlorine season. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's this. happening. It's Look happening. At this. Okay. All right. So takes the ladle, pours it in. This is the future, ladies and gentlemen. Is that exciting? Wow. Okay. Now yeah. what happens? Goes down into our goes in there, our container in the fridge. Wow! And it's up by tomorrow. That'll be full. Okay. It's kind of cool how robots are taking over, huh? isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> yes. We are in the future. Robots are taking over. <laughs> All right, viewers. This is very exciting. We are going up on the roof. This is one small step for man. One giant leap for Take a Hike Mike, Jay. Yeah. My show is reaching new heights. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> and we're here to help you. This is amazing, this view. Yeah. Do you ever just take lunch up here? Well, just... you know, yeah, you take stock up here every day. Once in a while, mm -hmm. you look around and go, yeah, this is all right. You kind of have a Mufasa moment where yeah. you just stand up here and say, all wow. of this purified water 
is yeah, ours. It's ours. What 1972 rock song by Deep Purple has the word water in the title? Oh, Do you know your classic rock, Jay? I don't. Not that one. Okay. Have you heard of the band Deep Purple? Oh, well, yeah, absolutely. Okay. It has water in the title. Yeah. It's not the, old black water. The first word is smoke. Smoke on the water. There you go. <laughs> so you can get bonus points if you can perform air guitar that famous riff from Smoke on the Water. Oh my. And if you need help, I can do it with you, Jay. You ready? I am ready, are, are you, you ready? Hum, are you gonna hum the beat? Oh yeah. All right, ready? Ready, here we go. Sing it with me. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Rock and roll, mate! Rock and roll! All right, so Jay, I understand you need my help with a job here. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We're back in the bar screen building here. Back at the bar screen building. And uh, this is considered a bad day. Okay. If you have to go down there and rake this manually like you're okay. going to do, okay. that's a bad day. It means things aren't working just the way they okay. should. Okay. So, so you need the help from Take a Hike Mike. Yeah. We're going to get down and dirty. Yeah. All right, should we Ready? do it? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Let's get down and dirty, viewers. All right, here we go. Just down this way? Yes, sir. There's that familiar smell again, Jay. That's the smell of money. That's the smell of money. We'll be filthy rich, it smells like. Okay, put some water in there. Oh, some gloves here, You're okay. Gonna need those. I'm gonna need these gloves. This is when we know we're getting dirty, viewers. All right. So, so we take that rake. Take the rake here? Okay, Jay. And reach down in. All right. And get as much of that stuff that's sitting in there. So you want me to pull that up? Up. And into this bucket? Yeah. Keep it off your nice clean shoes. Okay. Yes, sir. Man. Oh, wow. There's a Cheetos bag down here. Jay, were you snacking in here again? Yep. I'll put, put it on the floor. Put it on the floor and show it in. Oh, okay. Show it in. All right, so don't grab the turd, I was just told. Okay. This shop stinks. There we go. This is the dirtiest I've ever gotten on the show, I think. <laughs> Oh man, that, ugh, I just stepped on something soggy and squishy. Thanks a lot, Hastings residents. <laughs> Next time, keep your drains a little cleaner, please. How's this looking, guys? Pretty good. Do you approve of my skills, Jay? Yeah. All right, Jay. You can bring that up with you. All right, we're going to bring this up. Here we go. All right, so we got everything here, all the grossness. Yeah. This just goes in this dumpster now? Yep. Okay, good, because I don't think I can take this smell much longer. <laughs> Uh, there we go. Got all the trash in there. So Jay, how do we prevent all this junk from getting in there? Well, you know, we're going to get a certain amount of it anyhow. Yep. But when you have the flushables, mm -hmm. they're really not flushable. Okay. They don't break down. Mm -hmm. They clog up the pipes, the mm -hmm. sewers. It just causes a lot of trouble on the way down here. So if you, if you could refrain from flushing yeah. those sorts of things, so if it's I really a, appreciated. So, so if I have a bag of chips, you're telling me I should no longer flush it down the toilet? Yeah, absolutely not. Okay. Yeah. Don't flush your chip bags down the toilet, exactly. viewers. Exactly. <laughs> So, Jay, does the wastewater treatment plant have a website viewers should check out? Yes. Go to www.metrocouncil.org. Okay. Lots of good stuff and information about the, the plant here? Yeah. Cool. Yep. All, right. All of our plants. Okay. Sounds good. Check it out, viewers. And, Jay, I have a little gift for you here. It's called a hike ticket. The Hastings Wastewater Treatment Plant was featured on Take a Hike Mike, signed Mike Bramer. Would you like to display that in your plants? Oh, absolutely. Cool. Thank cool. you. All right. Well, Jay told me that the water here is now 99.7% clean. I'd say that's clean enough for old Take a Hike Mike to uh, do some swimming. Let's uh, jump in here. Hey, hey, oh, hey, hey. What? Mike, oh. what are you doing? Oh, what well, are you doing? Well, you, you, you can't go Jay, in there. Well, Jay, you no, told me. You, you can't go you, in there. No. You, Jay, hey, well, the thing is, Jay, take you a hike, oh, Mike. Oh, well, you told me it was clean enough take to swim. Hike. Okay, okay. Well, can I come back and swim another time? No. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for the opportunity, yeah. sir. All right. All right. Goodbye. <laughs> Where will I go next? I really can't say. Here's a little warning, cause it might be your way. No matter where I go, one thing is true. With Take a Hike, Mike, it's entertainment for you. Do you ever feel like your job is in the dumps? I, I think so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>